Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you all my favorite, top, best items for my baby that I love and that he loves. He will be turning nine months old in a couple days, July 2nd. So of course there's some things that I will be showing you that maybe he used more when he was a newborn and some stuff that he is starting to love now. I'm just going to go through everything. So the first thing that I want to start with is this right here. This is the Rock and Play Sleeper. I love this thing so much. This is something that my son slept in when he was a newborn. I got this and then I also got um a bassinet for him to sleep in and everybody told me that like he's not gonna like the bassinet he's never gonna sleep in it and a couple of people also told me that he was definitely probably gonna sleep in this but I just wanted him to sleep in the bassinet for some reason and I just didn't think that he would sleep in this but I was wrong and he loved this thing when he was a newborn I think it's the way that it holds their body real snug in here when I realized with the bassinet, I would be holding him, and he would be he would fall asleep, and then right when I would lay him in the bassinet, he was in this open space and he didn't feel secure, and that's exactly what this does. It fits their body real nice. You can strap them in, and he just loves it and he slept in it all the time, and it was a lifesaver. And then even when he didn't sleep in it anymore, I always put him in this, like I would put him in here. Um, just all throughout the house, I would do laundry while I was cooking. This would be one of the things that I would sit him in. This definitely came in handy. I just actually just put this away um, just recently because the strap part's too small and he will flip out of it now if I keep him in here. So yeah, this is going up in the attic, but this thing got a lot of use out of it and I highly, highly recommend it. Okay, moving on. Right, next is the Boppy, of course. The famous Boppy. And it's got a lot of use also. Um, I breastfeed my son and this was definitely a lifesaver. You just put it around you like this and they just lay right here nice and secure. Even, um, I'm sure when you feed him a bottle, this would also work great. I actually brought this to the hospital with me when I went to the hospital to have him and I used it and it was great. Also, another um, way this is great to use is I would just lay it on my bed and he would just lay right in the middle before he could sit up or anything like that. He would always lay in this thing on my bed. But yeah, there's a lot of different ways you can use this. You can also use it for tummy time, which is great. Right? This is just um, one cover and you can just take it off, throw it in the wash. I would recommend maybe two covers so you can switch them out. But yeah, love this. Highly recommend this. Another thing I just want to throw in here is this diaper bag. I'll have all the links down below. This was in my What's in My Diaper Bag video. And I just love this diaper bag so much. I got it from Babies R Us. It's been holding up great and yeah, I just love it. There's a million different compartments. It's big. The zipper, you can unzip and open it out more so it turns into even a bigger bag. Okay. Next, a very recent item that I got that I am loving right now. I just want to say I have the Moby Wrap. I used it here and there. It's just not one of my top items that I would recommend. But... I don't know, it's worth a try. My son just didn't like it that much. Maybe your baby will, but one thing that my son does love and that I wish I got a lot sooner is this Ergo Baby Carrier. I love, I love this thing so much. I only carried him in one position so far. You just put it on like this. Yeah, yeah you just put it on like this. It connects in the back, and this is actually a hood that can go over their head. 
if it's raining or if they fall asleep and you just want to put the sun out of their face, it snaps right here and it covers their head and they can still breathe and everything through the sides. So yeah, that's awesome. But yeah, I like it um, when he's facing inward, but he can also face out also, and also I think you can carry them on your back too, but so far I just used it with him facing in. And it's great, and another thing that's great is it straps around like this, and with this strap right here, all the weight goes here. So you don't feel any weight on your back at all. Like, it's great, and my son, he's a very big boy. <laughs> He's heavy, so if I don't feel any weight, that's just, that's wonderful. So yeah, I definitely highly recommend this, definitely over the Moby Wrap. Um, I wish I had this when he was a newborn, it would have, like, definitely come in handy back then, so yeah. It's definitely worth the money, it's a lot better than the cheap ones you can find, and it's just comfortable, I just love it so much. It's, it's definitely definitely worth the money and I'm so happy I I got this. So the next thing I want to show you is this Clark cover right here. The, this is the straps that it goes on. I'm going to actually put a picture right here of him in it so you can see um, what it looks like in the cart. So I'll insert that here. But yeah, this is the back part. It just goes on the cart like this. <laughs> this is kind of hard to show, but... Okay, in the front you have this pocket right here, and you can put, like, your cell phone, keys, whatever. And it has these little, um, things right here to hook toys on. And, yeah, uh, this is where the legs go through. And I like these straps because it goes around his chest up here. And, yeah, it just, um ties on the sides. It's kind of hard to show, but this is definitely a thing that comes in handy. Carts are really, really dirty and there's a lot of germs on them. So I love this thing. And it's funny because I don't know if you guys watch Daily Bumps, but uh, Missy has the same exact one for Oliver too. So I thought that was funny. But yeah, it's the Eddie Bauer one and this thing is great. Okay, next, this nose Frida. And let me just tell you, when I was doing my baby registry, for my, or when I was doing my baby shower registry at Babies R Us, I came across this thing. And I was like, no way am I getting that. I don't want it. That's gross. Anything that has to do with snot, drool, anything like that before I had my son just completely grossed me out. And I'm like, I am not sucking boogers out of my son's nose. But when he was born, that all changed. And this thing is not gross at all. Like, it might be gross when you think about it, but when it comes to your own baby, it's not gross at all. So I highly recommend this. And I recommend maybe putting like a couple of the uh, saline drops in their nose, and then you suck everything all out their nose, and you can get deep in there, and it's just great. So yeah, get this thing, and you'll thank me later. Okay, next, I'm not going in any particular order. I'm just, I kind of put everything all over here, so I'm just grabbing things. But next is this Gerber Organic Oatmeal Cereal. And this is what I started my son on, I guess, solids. I'm not really sure. Um, yeah. I just mixed, I pumped, I just mixed my breast milk with this. And it's a great way um, to start your baby on solids. It's organic, which is great. Everything about it I just love. And I started adding some fruit and stuff in it. Like either you can add some baby food in it or with me I make all my baby food. So I would add some like purees to it like apple, pear, stuff like that, carrots even, anything. It's just, it's great and I love this stuff and I still use it to this day. Next are these Johnson's Hand and Face Wipes. I love these things. I literally go through a pack a week. I'm not even kidding. Like, I stock up on these things. I use this when he eats, um, when we're out. I just, I always use these. They just come in handy for everything. And yeah, 
The Johnson's are good, but there's also other brands too that are great, but I love them and I go through them like crazy. Okay, next is this Desitin, which I am almost completely out of and need a new one, but my son actually hasn't gotten a diaper rash um, recently, so that's good. He always used to get them when he was younger, and this stuff, Desitin, the maximum strength is the only stuff that works for my son, and I have everything you can think of for diaper rashes, and this is the only stuff that worked, so I just wanted to throw this in here because it's definitely a favorite of mine and something that I will go for whenever he has a diaper rash, and luckily that hasn't been recently, but yeah, I'm telling you, this is the only stuff that works. <laughs> well, at least for me. Okay, another favorite of mine are these stickers, and they're so cute. There's one month all the way to 12 months, and each month you just put it on their shirt, and you can take a picture of them, and I just love these so much. It's great. I just love, like, looking at each month and ha watch him, how much he's grown from, like, the next month to the next month, and yet, he'll be using this number nine in a couple of days. I can't believe it. Okay, next is the best blankets you will ever find for your baby, and I cannot stress that enough. I have probably every single blanket you can think of, but these Aiden and Anaya muslim blankets are the best. It's this breathable material, they're thin and nice, they're big, really big, I can't even fit it all. <laughs> But yeah, and they come in all these different designs. You can get four in each pack, or I believe you can get them individually, but I would get the four pack. And I think they're around 30 something dollars. I'm not really sure, but they are worth the price. Like, I have so many different blankets, and these are the only ones my son used. And I, I ended up getting two packs, so I have eight total. And this is one right here. And then also, this is a different one, and there's just, there's so many cute designs, and I just love them, and they're perfect for uh, your newborn to swaddle them in. I would always swaddle him in these blankets and then put them right in the rock and play, and it was just great. I just love them, and I use them now for, like, so many different things. I just, these are the only blankets that I ever used for my son, so... Yeah, make sure to check out the link down below. And yeah, they sell them at Babies R Us. I know also Aiden and Anaya, um, I think, .com. They have their own website. So yeah, I love these, and yeah, I'm sure you will too. Okay, next I just wanted to add um, how I print out all my pictures. Snapfish.com. When you are a mother, you take pictures non-stop every day. At least I do. I take at least, I would say, three pictures a day of my son, which is crazy, I know. Of course, some more than others, or if you're like me, you use your phone a lot, and a digital camera, and stuff like that, and I just could not stand all my pictures just sitting on my computer and in my phone. I, I have a really nice printer that prints out pictures, but you know, the ink just runs out so fast, and I just found this to be the best way to print all your pictures. And yeah, here's a huge stack of pictures. I have to print some now. I have so many of these, but yes, yeah, Snapfish is the way to go. Okay, next is this car seat cover. I got this online. It just goes right over the car seat and this just straps up on the handle and then the inside is this material. And there's a whole bunch of different kinds that you can choose from. I found this online. I'm going to find it, um, the website and everything that I got it from so I will show you. But um, actually let me show you how it works. You just put this under like this and these velcro on the handle Oops. yeah like this
and the name is Car Seat Canopy, and it's carseatcanopy.com. But I'll leave all the links down below. But yeah, it just goes like this. And yeah, it's great when it's colder out or when it's raining or just in general just to get the sun out of their face. It's great. And then you just flip it over like this and it's a complete lifesaver. Okay, Nicholas has joined us. Um, next I'm going to show you this breast pump right here. This is just the regular hand pump that I got for free at the hospital. And um, yeah. This thing is great. I have um, an electric pump. I think it's the Playtex one, I think. I'm not really sure. It was a hundred and something dollars, and I used it for a little while in the beginning. And then I grew to just love the hand pump. It's so much easier and faster. You may have to sit there and go like this, but like when you're producing milk and you're breastfeeding, you can you can pump pretty fast with this thing. And yeah, it's just I just love it so much better, and just in case you were planning on buying a breast pump, um, I would wait and get one. If you're, I'm sure your hospital probably gives you one like this for free, so I would use this one first, see how you like it, and then maybe get an electric one after that if you're not satisfied with this one. I wish I did that. I would have saved some money, but yeah. Okay, next, of course, is a bouncer. <laughs> this one is great. I love it. I have another one too, but it's just the regular bouncer. So yeah, it's just this bouncer right here. I love it. Um, it just comes in handy. It has all the different things right here. And yeah, he doesn't really use these now too often. But when he did, he actually just stopped using it um, not that long ago. So I got a lot of use out of this. And you can feed them in it, put them in there. I would strap him in this and put him in the bathroom while I was taking a shower. Um, but yeah, just like what I said with it, rock and play, while you're cooking, while you're doing anything, you can just put them right in here. And also, it bounces, so you can put them to, to sleep in it and everything. So yeah, definitely by far one of my favorites. I would say maybe top five. But yeah, I'm sure you guys already know. Okay, next I am going to move on to teethers. This one that I got from my drugstore. I just picked it up randomly when I was in there. I saw it and I was like, okay, let me try this. And he loves this thing. It is by far one of his favorite ones. Okay, next, of course, is Sophie the Giraffe. And this little $20 squeaky toy. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely worth the money. Um, there's just something about it that they just love. Okay, next is this teething thing, whatever you want to call it. It vibrates when, when they um, bite on it. It vibrates. <laughs> And at first I was like, um, I don't know how much he's going to like that vibrating in his mouth, but it's definitely, it became one of his favorites. Alright, now moving on to toys. One of his favorite toys was, is this little radio thing right here. It plays music and lights up. And there's just something about it that he just enjoys so much. He was... When he was um, a newborn and smaller, he hated the car, and uh, it was a nightmare. Nothing I did worked, but as soon as he got this, he just loved it. In the car, he would just sit there with it, and it would just make him so happy. So, yeah, this was definitely a lifesaver, believe it or not, and... Yeah, it's Baby Einstein, and yeah, it's definitely one of his favorite toys. Next is his little Barney. I just got it. It plays um, the I Love You, blah, blah, whatever song. And yeah, I'm not going to play it because it goes on forever. But yeah, he loves this thing. Whenever I play it, he smiles and loves it. And I also um, always bring this out with us, too. 
Okay, next has been a favorite of his, I would say, since he was three months old. He got this for Christmas, and it is this toy right here. It's Leapfrog. It goes through the alphabet, and it has pictures and animals. And, yeah, he learned how to do this. That was one of the first things he learned how to do. And he just loves this toy so much. This is definitely, definitely one of his favorites. See, he put down my uh, fresh pump for it. It's always been a favorite of his. And if you see it, I would definitely recommend getting it and seeing if your little one likes it. Okay, the next toy is this toy right here. It lights up. And it's just like one of the one of those uh, plastic ones, just a little bit better. And this is another toy that he just loves so much. These few toys that I'm showing you is pretty much the only toys that he like really plays with. He has every single thing you can think of. <laughs> And these couple toys is like really all he needs and always picks from. So yeah, he just enjoys it so much. There's just something about it. I think whatever plays music and lights up, he is all about. <laughs> Alright, next is probably his favorite toy out of all of them. And it's this Bright Stars toy right here. It's just like a little table, it has the legs, and it also comes with little balls that you put through here, and then they end up on the leg, that comes through onto the leg. Now that he stands up, he um, plays with it like this, but these legs come off. So before he started, <laughs> before he started standing up, I didn't put these legs on and it just, this white part just sat on the floor and he would sit here and play with this thing for so long. It just really holds his attention and it lights up, it plays music and everything and he just loves it so much. Okay, so the next thing I want to show you guys is this strap right here that I ordered off of Etsy. And as you can see, you can put it around a toy like this, and you can strap this around um, their high chair, the stroller, car seat, anything. So if the toy drops or if they throw it or anything, it doesn't fall on the floor. And it comes in handy when you go to restaurants or when just anywhere, out in public, whatever the case may be. And also the cart cover that has loops on there and I also connect that to it and so on the cart he also has this. Um, you can wrap it around Sophie the giraffe which is great because Sophie gets very dirty and is really not that easy to clean so this is great. Okay so the last thing I want to show you guys is probably one of my favorite items and it is the jumper roo. And he still uses this and probably will for a little while and has been I think around four months he started using this. I'm not really sure. But it has um three different levels that you can put it on for the height. And um when he was younger when he first started using it, he didn't reach the floor, so I would just put a pillow underneath or something like that. But yeah, he loves this thing. I love this thing. It really holds his attention for a while. He loves jumping on it. Out of all of them to choose from, this is the one that I love the best, and it was the most bouncy. And yeah, I'll, I'll have a link down below like everything else. It has a little mirror, this little lion he loves. And these that go like this, and a little monkey, and this thing lights up, and it plays music. It has all the different options right here. And yeah, it's just great. It spins around like this. You just can't go wrong with this thing. And I'm telling you guys, <laughs> it is a lifesaver. Okay guys, so that's it for this video. I hope you found it helpful in some way and enjoyed it. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up. And hopefully you subscribe to my channel, and I will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!